hi everyone welcome back to another video and this is part two of lovers leap vlog now i hope you like the silent vlog in part one i saw your feedback in the comment section thank you it was my first time trying something like that but based on the scenic view i really wanted you guys to get a glimpse of what i saw on my journey to lovers leap now part two is not silent um, it's a shorter video and I hope you will enjoy when we got to lovers leap it was actually closed we actually saw some tourists on the outside and we stopped and they were telling us that they were getting the caretaker sorry to bring them in we were lucky enough when they were coming out to get the caretaker to show us around the place so you'll definitely see that in the vlog so the the road trip wasn't a waste and it was very fun i'm back in canada guys yes coat scarf all these things i miss jamaica i miss the sunshine i miss the people i miss my family but you know keeping it real on the journey we're getting closer to 1k so remember to like share comment and if you're not subscribed yet what you waiting for subscribe to my channel because there is something for you now and in the future now we're gonna get into the video and i'm gonna show you what i was able to see of lovers leap i hope you do enjoy the rest of this vlog and big up many thanks again to the caretaker who took us around and gave us some of his time to allow us to get in although lovers leap is closed at this point in time hoping that it will be back up and running and lots of visitors will go and request for seeing the place will you know bump up so they can get back on a roll see you in the end of the video oh and of course you know there is no road trip without food so in the end of the video i'll show you where we stopped thanks for watching when your dreams come alive you're unstoppable take a shot chase the sun find the beautiful we will go in the dark so this is walnut tree guys and look, you see, see the little things there and, and that's how it looks mommy, mommy. we're gonna crack it open these are the two lovers that actually yeah, went down the cliff okay Mizzy and Tooney. This is the highest elevation of lighthouse in the world. Oh wow. Most lighthouse is the sea level. Right. This is on the mountain. Oh, so that means that we see way over. The elevation is 1700 feet. Wow. So I can imagine when you go up and look how it looks. <laughs> Go on, Naya. No, she's videoing, so you have to Alright, I'll come. Oh, wow. You guys know Anata? Anata? Yeah, yes, when you use it, my dear. Okay. Mommy, use it. Wait, yeah, what do you use Anata do? Yeah, it's, it's the same thing that makes paprika in. Yes. This little something? You don't know Anata call it? Yeah, uh -uh. the seeds. <laughs> yeah. Mommy, have some in the cupboard. Mm -hmm. Oh, jeez. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Yeah, yeah. Guys, I'm so happy I got to came in. Come in. <laughs> Guys, I'm so happy I got to come in to show you this beautiful view. Look at... Oh, that's Pedro Bluff? Uh-huh. So guys, that's Pedro Bluff. Oh my God. Look at God's beautiful creation -y. So I'm hearing that people walk down this trail guys. There's a little gazebo right where you're seeing that umbrella. And it takes about an hour and a half from up here from land level 
going all the way down to sea level to get there but this is absolutely beautiful my god wow yeah, you see these flowers this is the location where the two slaves jump where the flowers is red flowers oh so they jumped right yeah, from here wow they were running away from the slave master and it was dark uh-huh and they heard the sound of the sea and thought they could jump into the sea to escape oh so they by my god so do you think their bodies rolled all the way down or they it just died on the, the cliff stuck somewhere up down there stuck the and they just died yeah wow i used to do it a lot you swim in there yeah I'm there. Yeah, but I don't see you. You know, can't, I can't drive one beach, so I'm gonna walk down Wow. Guys, it's so unfortunate that um, the property has to be closed pretty much because of covid and not a lot of visitors are coming so they can't have it opened but as i said i'm happy we got a chance to come in the caretaker allowed us to come in and have a look and i'm so happy about that that we got the opportunity but it's absolutely beautiful where you see that white little thing in the the water there that looks to me like there is a boat down there but yeah it's absolutely breathtaking absolutely alrighty then so make sure you like up the video share subscribe and I hope that you totally enjoyed having a look at what lovers leap is like even though the property is closed but hopefully it will be back open again and the persons are able to visit and have a look at this wonderful property and just enjoy yourselves so i'm headed to the gate to go back outside thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the scenery and you're blessed up you're happy to see what jamaica looks like in terms of saint elizabeth jamaica i was so so awed by the fact that there is just mountains all around look at the beautiful sky oh my god look at that and with that note bye guys remember your dreams are possible <laughs>